Hello and welcome back to a brand new video on the channel. Today I'm going to be showing you how you can set up a brand new iPhone 17. And we're going to be transferring all of the data over from our old phone here onto our new phone. So if you're doing that today, we are here to help you out. Nice. It'll come exactly like this, mm -hmm. the screen cover. Phone. The old one is currently on and connected to Wi-Fi. You want to hit the power button and start to turn on the new iPhone. The iPhone has switched on, swipe up, select the language, which is English. Select your region, select the size of the icons you would like, hit continue. Now here is where we can set up our new phone utilizing our old phone so that all of the apps, the data and the photos easily transfer across. Now straight away, you'll see by tapping my screen there, it brought to life my old phone, sorry, and it came up with this window saying set up new iPhone. It's going to say unlock to continue. We're going to type in the password and it's going to ask to hold the camera above our new phone, getting the blue dots in the circle. It'll say getting things ready. Now it's going to say set up new iPhone. If you're setting up for yourself, say set up for me. Now on our new phone, we need to enter the passcode of our old phone. So what exactly is going on here? Well, all of the data, including the photos, the apps, the icons, the passwords are being transferred over from your old phone to your new phone. If you get a message saying this iPhone cannot be activated without an internet connection, this is no worries at all because the first time it wasn't connected to Wi-Fi, now it is connected to Wi-Fi. We're gonna select try again. So that's just a weird bug that sometimes happens because the very first time you try and transfer all the data across, it doesn't have Wi-Fi, so it fails. But if you select try again, the second time, the Wi-Fi has been transferred from your old phone to your new phone and thus it works. Now we go through the setup uh, process on the new phone. Face ID, we're gonna set up this. Uh, and the next thing that'll ask is transfer your data. So would you like to download your data from your iPhone? So this will include everything that was on this phone. It will take one hour, uh, but you can transfer data from your old phone to your new phone instantly like that. This includes all of the things like your photos being transferred over, your apps, your files, your digital wallets, so your cards, your passwords, and your messages. Here it's gonna ask if you want this to become your primary phone. If this is your new phone, then you wanna select yes. Hit continue. Do you, you want notification summary on? Do you want priority notifications? There's a new button, by the way. Siri, how's the weather? Amazing. So Siri has been set up with the person whose phone it is. My satellite, that's all. And now we're into the phase we talked about earlier, transferring the data, whether you're transferring from an iPhone 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16 to a 17 or a 17 Pro, Pro Max. This is the exact steps that follow. So we just have to wait here while all of the files are downloaded and transferred over. And based on how many files, photos, and how much data you have on your phone, the time for this will vary. So after a short while, you get this message saying on the old phone, the transfer has been complete and you'll notice your new phone already has the same background image as before on your old phone. It's going to ask, and the passcode is exactly the same. The restore will be complete. You can select continue. It's going to transfer your phone number across from your old phone to your new phone. We do want this to happen. This can always feel like the nerve wracking bit, especially when you're going, for example, to an eSIM, whereas before you may have had a physical SIM, but Apple handle this very well. Uh, device added to your account. You can select okay for this. Continue on your new phone. And here we can now see that the brand new iPhone has been set up. All of the apps have been transferred from the old iPhone to the new iPhone and they're downloading as we speak. The photos are also transferred over and so are the notes, which is great news. The one thing that we had a tiny bit of struggle with when it came to setting up the iPhone was transferring across the number. So we're going to go on to do that now manually. On the right, we have the old iPhone with the number attached because we can see the signal at the top. And on the left, we have the brand new iPhone that has been set up. If we would like to transfer over the number from the old iPhone to the new iPhone, which is eSIM only, this is iPhone 17, and we're doing it for reference from an iPhone 13 to an iPhone 17. I'm gonna come over here. I'm gonna scroll down to mobile service, and I'm going to select set up mobile service. Then it's going to say transfer phone number. You can transfer a phone number from another iPhone. So here we can see the same thing that came up during the setup phase that very quickly disappeared. Ultimately, we want to select transfer from iPhone and it should indeed say that another number nearby is available and that is the correct number from this phone that is gonna be transferred over to this phone. So I select transfer number and it's going to ask me to continue the transfer on the old phone. This message saying confirm the transfer. Then it's going to say continue the transfer and confirm the transfer on the new phone from the old phone. Select okay. 
We need to confirm the transfer on the old phone by doing Face ID. It's then going to say transferring phone number. Keep this phone turned on until the transfer is complete. And weirdly enough, at the moment, nothing is happening. So there we can see on the old phone, the number has currently disappeared. And after about five minutes of being stuck in what seemed to be an unknown blank space, if we select, for example, mobile service, you'll then see that the banner has come up and all the details are below. The number and the data is also down there but I won't show that for safety reasons. And of course the signal is in the top right hand corner. Now the old phone has no longer got the number or signal there, so it's all transferred over to the new phone. And that is exactly how to set up a brand new iPhone from start to finish with everything transferred over. Thank you for watching today's video. Take care, leave a like, thank you.